And we are back. What's good, Internet? I am here yet again to play through some more Resident Evil 7 in VR. Back once again to fight some more mold men in the downstairs area. So that is our kind of goal here for the moment. I think I'm good on on items. Got my scorpion key, got some gunpowder, got an open spot for something. Actually, I got two open spots here for something, so that's helpful. So we're, we're, we're gonna head downstairs again and take out some more mold assholes. That's the plan anyway, um, because that is, oh, that door's still open. That is, uh, we are on the road to the shotgun, and again, I, I have played through this particular section before, so I do know where I'm going, up until a certain point. And I will definitely definitely, definitely let you know what that point is. Uh, but I am not there just yet. So, I do believe our next goal uh, is in there, but first and foremost, there are some more things to pick up in here, I believe. I haven't been in there yet, even in my other save file. I haven't been in there yet, so... That's going to be on my agenda, but I feel like there was something else here that I didn't pick up last time. Yes, a lockpick. Lockpick is a useful... A useful. So I need to go... Chem fluid. And head through here. Because... There's some shotgun shells. Oh, right, this is the snake door, I'm sorry. Not enough space for shotgun shells, and not enough space for psycho stimulants. This was the wrong way. My bad. These things happen. So, for real this time, I believe that this is... Uh, and I want to hit uh, L2 and triangle to get the good ammo. Because there's going to be some guys in here. There's going to be... I, I have seven shots, and the good ammo uh, will do two shots. I, actually, no. I'm sorry. I don't want the good ammo just yet. But I do not... Don't fucking do that. I do know that there will be a guy over here. You're good. Three. And then if I... Yep. I knew you were there. Brother Moldy. I knew you'd come. Asshole. Don't appreciate that. Uh, running low on ammo, but fucking whatever. I can always make more. I can always make more. I got plenty of chem fluid. Uh, I can always make more. So. Wait, that's chem fluid and chem fluid. So we'll do chem fluid and combine with that. And now we have more ammunition. I believe there's one more guy in this hallway. No, I'm sorry. Not not the case. I'm mistaken. There are three guys in here. And they're assholes. So we get the good ammo for these three assholes. You right there. Hi. One, two. I know there's two more of y'all in here. I know you want to come out to play. See, I don't like this shit at all. Even though I know. Even though I know. There are more individuals in here. Like, it still... Makes me nervous. Like, even when you know it... Like, that's, that's the hallmark of a good horror game. Because you know... There's shit in here... Shit! And you still don't want to do it. Ah, god damn it! Fuck, fuck, fuck. Lock! Run! Like I said, the hallmark of a good horror game is when you know and you still go, no, you know what? I don't want to go in there. Because it's some fucking horse. God damn it! Die! Ah, <sighs> wasted a damn freaking health thing, which is not 
didn't want to do that. I'm not happy about it. Combine. One more. Back in the green. Okay, that should have solved that issue. My ammo situation is I have ten bullets, uh, but I should be getting a shotgun pretty soon. And uh, I can't quite get... Actually, I, I can quite get that. That should be all the individuals. There should be just three. Don't make me a liar, video game. Don't make me a liar. Okay. Do that. Mo old. Alright, so there. Close this door. I don't trust you. There is the key that we need. Not grabbing it just yet. For reasons you will see here shortly. So there's a boss fight in that direction, I believe. And we're going to say, hey, let's get this key. Let's get this key. Oh, wait. Hi. Look. I'm right here. Follow the buzzards. De okay. Now then. That's important for one reason. Uh, we're not going to do this, this fight just yet. That's important for one reason. And that reason being that tri having him trigger and go into that room, which is where the fight is, uh, means that he will not be in the area that has the shotgun. And granted, I could have gone and gotten that shotgun much earlier and shot all those mold guys with that shotgun, but that's kind of a waste of ammo for that shotgun. Now, I don't know if there are more mold guys that might trigger here, so I'm not going to be too surprised if there were. But I am hopeful that there aren't. The most hopeful. Running, running, running. Closing. Closing! Okay, now what did I miss here? There were some shotgun shells. That room still. I'm going in that room, I swear. It's gonna happen. It just hasn't happened yet. Um, bottom of the stairs, there were some shotgun shells that I missed. Shotgun shells, psychostimulants, and there's the fucking snake door. I don't have a snake key, which is no good. I do have a scorpion key, though, so that is going to help us out here tremendously very shortly. So, the fuck? Don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, so that means we can ignore that. I think this is still locked. Yeah, it's locked. That's closed. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. I'm gonna keep saying this while I believe it. And then we go. I think this, this, this door is locked as well, or blocked. No, it's not, huh. Wait, where is this? Oh! Oh. I didn't know that. That just, that just loops around. Huh. Well, you learn something every day. Now I know that that room is not a room I, I haven't been in. It's just a door I didn't go through. My bad. My bad. I need to open this up with a lockpick. What is in here? What could it be? I don't actually know. Oh, hang on, Amla. That's, that's not super useful, but hey. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm sure there are better uses for that lockpick, but, you know, is what it is. Uh, so now, now that we have the scorpion key, uh, make sure we have enough uh, room in our inventory to hold a shotgun, which should be just two spots, I'm pretty sure. Um, actually, let's just, just make 100% sure here. Okay, three open spots in our inventory, which means we can head and use the scorpion key uh, over here and get us back into the main hallway, which is right there. So the benefit of having Jack now not be in... This area means we can wander around freely and not get attacked by his dumbass who you can't kill. And that's the most annoying thing in the world. Um, so that is 
the plan is to go up here and use the scorpion key. And hey, look who's gone. Look who's gone. How about that? So yeah, uh, personally wouldn't want to have to deal with Jack just to get in that room to get that damn broken shotgun. That sounds like a fucking hassle. So having him trigger earlier uh, is honestly super useful. Scorpion key. Wakey, wakey. All right. Shotgun shells. What else is in here? Nothing. A note. Dear Mrs. Baker, uh, your cranium has fungus-like structures that seem to be related to mold. Hallucinations and noises, because you've got mold in your brain. It's a fungal parasite. You should probably get it removed. Yep. Good call, doctor. Good call. That's some uh, dentures. I don't know why. I don't, I'm not sure why that's a thing there. More handgun ammo. There we go. Broken shotgun, baby! And that lets us get to the next thing that we need. Um, oops. So, yeah, so you can see the shotgun takes up two spaces there. So, yes, Resident Evil inventory management, which, you know, I'm not a big fan of, but. It's part of the genre. It's part of the game. It's a thing that you deal with uh, as you are trying to survive these horrors in this game. So let's head down here and get the shotgun. And then go to the part that I had not seen yet, which is the new stuff. Which, you know, well, for it's, it's new for me anyway. Um, what? Are you fucking serious, bro? Are you fucking serious? I want to put... God damn it. Two more spots are... God damn it. Jump cut. Now then. Where were we? We put the broken shotgun there. And that is how it is done. Now I have a shotgun. How about that? Catch me outside. How about that? With uh, plenty of ammo. Uh, and I obviously don't want to use too much of it. So we're not going to use it unless there's an actual emergency to use a shotgun for. But... Uh, yeah, so we got a shotgun now, and now we head back down to the... Actually, before that, before that, there's a very important thing to hit here. Uh, one of the things that we found was a picture. And that picture showed a hidden block to press for a treasure. And that treasure is going to increase our health uh, and uh, stamina? I mean, it's just health. In any event, you can't do it until the game lets you. And that is right here. Hit that button, and get some steroids! Do some Brock Lesnar shit. Juicing. Yeah. Increases max health, which is, uh... Hell yeah! Just hook it to my veins! Alright, there we go. Max health has increased. Awesome. Awesome. Unfortunately, there, there's no real numerical representation of that, because you just got this watch with a fucking, you know, uh... Green line on it, but whatever. Um, so yeah, I think I'm good on things I want to have in my, in my inventory. Um, I think I'm doing alright. So, uh, I suppose, since I don't have a thing to open this door yet, I suppose we can go see Jack. I still don't like this room. At all. Not a fan. Fuck off. Anyway, now, finally, I am entering into unknown territory, and I am back to being a little bit hesitant to do anything for any reason. Because I just saved, and I'm probably gonna die. Probably gonna die. Jack. How about that? Let's do it. Let's do this? Well, that seems... This all seems real bad. This is a real bad scene. I don't like it. That door's... Uh... Can I open this door? I can. Hey, Mr. Officer! Yes, poor deputy. Not, not poor me. Poor deputy. There's some chem fluid. This game, like, older Resident Evil games, they would, you know, sparkle, uh... For items that you wanted to pick up, whereas this game just kind of hides shit everywhere, which I think is actually kind of cool in VR. I'm not sure how much I'd, I'd appreciate it in 2D, but 
in VR seems seems all right because it, it encourages you to kind of like you know lean over and look around and whatnot, um, and that's kind of cool. Oh, I don't want to touch that, do I? That's the thing to get to what I want, which is the dog's head. Uh, all right, let's make sure I didn't miss anything, like a bobblehead or there's another snake door. I bet that's the same snake door that I couldn't get into from the other side. That seems like a pretty good guess as to what the fuck that is. Gunpowder. Thank you. That looks like some kind of weird carcass. Yeah, it does pay to kind of look in things and look around and whatnot, so... It pays to be... That texture just freaked out there. Pays to be vigilant. Okay, it, I guess it's time to go fight Jack. I put it off long enough. Not enough inventory space. You motherfucker! There. How about that? Cutscene. Oh, hi, yeah. That's about right. Oh, not cool, Jack. Not cool. Catch me outside! Oh, crap. Really? What the fuck? I can't even get away! Asshole! Oh, yeah. Sure. What the fuck? This is some bullshit. He's always, like, right on me. There we go. Catch me outside. Oh. How about that? Nope. What are you doing? What are you doing, Jack? What are you doing? Oh. There's a chainsaw. Oh. There's a double chainsaw? That is not... That is not groovy, Jack. That is not groovy. Give me that. Not enough space, you motherfucker! Gonna die. Gonna die. Okay, now we know to have more space next time. No. Nope. Fuck you. Right in the face. I'm pretty sure I need, I need that chainsaw, so just fucking kill me. Yup. 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 I did die. Good to know. Yeah, alright. We're gonna have to go back to that item box and put more stuff in the item box. Shit, man. Not enough space for the chainsaw. Okay, that was a hassle. Let's do this shit again. I have four spots now. Four spots. And here comes the hand. Hey, buddy. How you doing? I got four spots. He's immediately too fucking close. Catch me outside. How about that? Not cool. Oh, come on. There's no fucking escaping his bullshit. Really? You loaded one fucking round? Really? Why? There we go. How about that? And now we get the chainsaw shit. So, now... Yeah, me too. Me too. Ha-ha! What? There we go. Chainsaw fight. Motherfucking chainsaw fuck. Chainsaw fight! Boy! How do I hurt him? I don't even know. Shit. I'm not sure if it's working or not. Turn on the engine? What the fuck? Oh, that's not good. Shit! I don't like that at all. How about that? Oh, shit. 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 I don't like this. What did that even say? I missed it. What did it even say? Shit. L2, R2 for a thrust attack. 
All right. What do you know? Eat my ass! I don't like you, Jack. In your face! What the fuck is happening? This is real hard in VR, by the way. Really? Really? Yeah, I do look worried. Because you're an asshole. And I'm out of fucking healing items, which is not cool. Uh, really? I was ducking. You're fucking full of shit. I hate you. Stop. Get the fuck away. Reload your goddamn shotgun. I hate this fucking shit. This is real fucking hard in VR, by the way. Fuck you, Jack. Fuck you. I'm dead. I'm dead again. I don't know what I should be doing here. Retry. Yeah, yeah. Hi! Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, a couple of shotgun shots. We'll take care of his ass. And then that's a problem. Because reloading is a problem. Oh, come on. Fuck you, Jack. Go get your shit. Come on. Go get your... There you go. Oh, go get your shit. Yeah, go, go do your thing. Come on, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. There we go. In your face! What? Did I win? Is that all it took? Oh, no, that's not... Nope. Nope. I need to move. Oh. Chainsaw in your body! It's just your body! Oh. oh, that sucks. Heal, 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 heal! Oh man, oh man, oh man, restart your fucking chainsaw. Ah, uh, you can... Yep. Fucker. Get chainsawed. You missed. Right up your ass. See what I care. Oh, shit. Shit! Restart the fucking chainsaw. Ah. Really? It's like in him. There we go. There we go. Just deal with it. That had to be it. That had to be it. Three times is a video game. Three times is a video game. Am I? No. Oh. He can't possibly be dead. Really? You're gonna get up after that, bro? Fuck. You. Eat it, yeah! That's not gonna happen. What was that? Oh, some health. Oh, I could definitely use some. Anyhow, who? Uh, let me go back to the save room and save, and that'll be it for today. We definitely did a thing. We definitely did a thing here in Resident Evil 7. 
Sure. I mean, that seems inefficient, but sure. There has to be an easier way to do that. There we go. Oh, I broke the chainsaw! Right, I guess there was no other way out of here. That sucks. Well, that's how they prevent you from using the rest of the game, right? You say, no, you, you're fucked now, son. No chainsaw for you! Oh, trophy. I think that was a trophy. Either that or uh, something I was downloading, finished downloading. One of the two. Now, of course, they wouldn't be such big assholes to spawn more mold men, would they? Would they? Because I'm running. I'm running back to that fucking save room. One of my ass! Someone is singing. I don't like whoever was singing there. Fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. Okay! That, my friends, wraps up another episode of Resident Evil 7 in VR next time. Assuming there's going to be a next time. I will finally be in back into undiscovered territory for myself. And I won't know what to do. And that could make things scarier. I hope. Anyway, I'm Attack Slug. Thanks for watching. More videos every day. See you next time. Right here on this channel. And I'm out.